going through a dry run right now just to function the machine so that the we can video just basically what the machine does in, in the forming site. Okay, go ahead. Okay, here's the tube now we're going to place inside the guys and ready to form. Okay, Steve, load it. We're going to open the safety door, place the tube inside the bottom seal. Close the safety door. Now we'll go through an automatic cycle. Spacers are in. Form. The top seal is coming down and going inside the tube. Now it seals itself. The dice around the part on both ends, apply pressure, pressure is formed, is taking place, part is formed, dies will separate, just enough to eliminate die marks. The tube. This is the tube that goes inside the machine. Front door, which is, has a safety mechanism, so the machine will not operate without that door being closed. He's inserting the tube into the bottom seal. Closes the face panel. Now he'll start to form the automatic cycle. The top seal is advancing into the tube. The guides are surrounding the tube. The part is being pressurized, the spacers are retracted, <laughs> hold it, no it's okay, on and on, on, shit. Here is the part all formed. Now Steve will remove the part. Drain the oil into the, into the machine so you don't get it around anywhere and it goes in the trough. Okay Steve. Only right in the middle to look at. Okay. Steve is going to insert a part into the machine again. Opens up the front door. It has a safety, electrical safety. The machine will not operate without that door being shut and a micro switch made. Now we will start the form operation. The top seal is going into the tube and will seal itself. The dies will now surround the tube and hold pressure. Pressure is being applied into the tube. The tube is now being formed. The dies will separate so it's not damage the tube. Forming die pops up again. Okay. Now you can remove the tube, Steve.
because of the spacers being moved in there, to position the dies for the right pitch point. I think that's it for now, Steve. <laughs>